here's their first YouTube video. They seen some videos of homesteading and they want to try it themselves. They've pretty much got this cage lot in their own garden that they've seen on YouTube from homesteading. You see they still working. Alright Jess, Paul. Y'all come over and tell us about you. About your garden that y'all got going on over here. This is a huge garden that you've got going on here. What What's the size of it? It's a 30 by 50. 30 by 50? Yeah, uh, we tilled it with the front end tiller. Yeah. Uh, I still got a little bit more to do right here. A little uh, tilling and a raking right here. And then the garden should be done. Ready to plant? Ready to plant. What do you think? Maybe you'll be ready here maybe another week? Yeah. All right. Good job. Paul, what? What? What, what gave us this idea? We've been watching some homesteading videos about uh, trying to live more off the land. On YouTube? Mm hmm Cool, cool. And, uh... What you, what's you, some of your favorites? You got one? We got a favorite. Yeah, you got a favorite on there you like to watch? Mm hmm yeah. Which one? Y'all watched a couple videos and then y'all started wanting to come out here with the garden. Yeah. Y'all got you to... Jesse, you dig these holes? Yeah. Dug these holes where you post everything? Good deal. Yeah. Dug them in, put concrete in them, let them dry. Uh, we put yes. a fence, we put a board down in the middle. Yeah. So if the goats tried to lean up and push up on it, the fence would push back on them so it wouldn't bring down. So you're going to get you some goats, uh, chickens. Yeah, going to sit some chickens on the end there. And uh, rabbits, right? Tell me about your, your garden here. It doesn't look the best as in far as like dark soil like I see on other people's gardens. Well, we wanted to start off this year with not using no compost. Yeah. To see uh, how we would do just uh, by itself this year. Okay. And then next year we're going to use a uh, compost and see which one does better uh, this year or the next. Okay, so this year you're just going by the soil itself. Yeah. And uh, the next year you're going to add you some compost and fertilizer see how it does next year yeah but i think that'd be pretty good pretty good little idea now uh so you're going to y'all going to take some ideas y'all got from youtube and y'all going to try working in here on your zone yeah now i think you got a little chicken cage in there built you're going to put you uh, in the fall let your chickens kind of uh turn your garden a little bit yeah we're gonna we have a small box built about four by three yeah and we're gonna put them in each section Oh, you're going to uh, kind of move it around a little bit. We're going to move it uh, like two a day. Okay. We're just going to let them fertilize their own garden. Probably going to do that, I guess, more than around the fall, I guess. Yeah. I heard that. Yeah, we're going to wait until the fall before we uh, do it. And what size did you say this garden was? 30 by 50. 30 by 50? Yeah, it's a big garden. Mm -hmm. So you think you can do it? Yeah. We Y'all going to survive off the land for a while anyways? Yeah, we're going to yeah. try our best. Mm -hmm. We're going to try it. Yeah, I heard that. All right. What's your name now? Jesse. Jesse and Paul. And what y'all call y'all self? Napier Homestead Farms. Do what? The Napier Homestead Farms. Uh oh, there we go. All right. All right, we're back. This is the pen that these boys have built and cage. I believe this is for their goats, for their rabbits. See what they got going on over here. What you boys doing? Making our fence stronger. Well, I heard that. Is this your chicken lot? Yeah. Looks pretty good for how many chickens you got now? Got 15. You got 15, got them in the house getting ready, don't you? Mm hmm. I can't wait to get them out. Yeah, we got them under the lamp. You're driving your mom crazy. Yeah. So, you're going to try to stick with 15? You're going to get more? Or? Yeah, we're thinking about getting a little bit more and extending the chicken cage a little bit. Extend yeah, it out? Yeah, yeah, but I think we have, for 15 chickens, I think it's pretty good for a little bit. Just to try it out. I heard that. Now, we get, me and your mom's giving y'all this corner rope here, let y'all do what you want. It seems like y'all done real good. This garden is still looking good. This cage and everything is looking good. Now what's this up here? Is this where your other animals gonna be? Yeah, we're putting our goats in there. Putting your goats? Yeah. 
That's, that looks pretty good. It looks pretty good for a few goats in there. Yeah. Everything looks pretty good. Okay, got a top on it. And what's this thing gonna be? Uh, we're thinking about getting a few more pallets and putting them on the side into the bottle. Yeah. And it's gonna hold our, uh, our stacks of hay. Okay, gonna put your hay over here. Yeah. Gotta throw it over the top or something, I guess. I heard that. Lay it down in there, have them a little bed. I heard that. What's that right there, Paul? You been? I seen you fooling with that thing, or what are you doing there? Well, when the goats uh, in the morning, we're gonna let them free roam around here. And this is where gonna be like their little play spot or something. It's gonna be like a little toy for them? Yeah. Well, I heard that. Y'all gonna get you one of them tree stumps over and pull it over and see if they wanna play on it, too? Yeah, we're probably gonna play it like right there in the middle there. I heard that. We, don't good, want it, good. we don't want it too close to the fence so they have they can jump over it. Yeah. Oh, I heard that. That's right. That's right. That'll be yep. bad. Now, what was y'all doing yesterday? I seen y'all working on the top up here. What was y'all doing to your pen? We was rain harvesting. What? Rain harvesting. Rain harvesting. Mm -hmm. Where'd you hear that from? You too. Mm -hmm. All right, show me. What, what's rain harvesting? There he goes. Going to show me what rain harvesting is. I seen that garbage can. Now tell me what, what is rain harvesting? What what is what does it deal with? Well I didn't want to go back and forth with the bucket to water the chickens oh, and going, the goats. Oh yeah, going from back and forth to the house. Yeah, it's a long walk. We'd have to go back and forth going back to the water and then watering the dog, the garden, the animals. Yeah. So I figured, I looked up on YouTube, but easier way, and we found a rain harvest thing. So when it rains, we have a board here, and puts a little slant into the tin on top. Okay. So it will go down, and it'll land into a gutter that has a little bit of a slant into it. Okay, yeah, I've seen that gutter. Yeah, and then it drops into the bucket. No. Nah. We're, we're wanting to get to a bigger bucket, so we can hold more water into it. Do they have water in it now? Just a or, little bit. Well, hand me a... Uh, Bucket. Yeah, let's see. Uh, show them that gutter. Yeah, you dump it into it and I'll. I'll dump it in there? Yeah, dump it on top there. Alright. Let me know when you're ready. Go ahead. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's pretty good. 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 Yeah, that's Yeah, so after it rains, we can just come out here and dump the bucket into the container and uh, water the chickens. Water the chickens and the animals don't even have to come back inside, do you? Well, I heard that. That was real smart. That's called what now? Rain harvesting. Rain harvesting. Well, I heard that you'll have to think uh, you have definitely getting you a bigger bucket. That's a 55-gallon tub. Be nice to get you one of them big water tanks. Yeah. That's we're all that's... To, Yeah, we're wanting to put another uh, pop down there, too. Yeah, put another one? Yeah, so we can get it all the way down from top there all the way to the bottom. I heard that. That was sort of good. And then you got that off of YouTube? Mm-hmm. Well, good deal. Now, what did what you say, Paul? Y'all was calling yourselves? Napier Homestead Farms. There we go. And what are you going to be doing on Napier Homestead Farms? We're going to be watering our animals, planting. Planting? Maybe. That might extend it. Might going like to extend it? No spot over there. I seen you got you some more posts. So now you're going to uh, upload this on YouTube, right? Mm -hmm. All right, good luck, guys. What's your name? Jesse. Paul. Paul. And what y'all calling yourselves? Napier Home Napier Homestead Farms. All right.